Hey, what's going up guys? My name is Austin and welcome back to another video. Here I'm representing my group member Charaka and Galang and we are going to show you some sort of C++ codes to find out the value of scene using the system calculator and tailor method. Now, first things first, we need to open the uh, C++ IDE. Right now I'm using CodeBlocks version 12.11. The first thing you need to do is to make a new project. Select console application, click go, select C++, and uh, give your project a name. For example, I'm using a Taylor, Taylor Swift. I'm sorry, just joking. Taylor method. And then click next, finish. And then open the main CPP file. Here it is. These are the codes. These are the general uh, structure of the C++ codes. Just delete this line. And here we can see that there's a line of code that says include iostream. Uh, it is required for, for use of C in and C out. And in the preprocessor directives part, we need to add a one more library, which is a CMath library. Include CMath, and it is required to use sin, cos, and po functions in C++. So the next thing we need to define the fee value. Define value well I have it just copy and paste the value of V and after that uh, let's start with the main program the first thing we need to do is we need to initialize the sin variable as double type with parameter angle long double Scene Taylor and the parameter double angle. After that, initialize the factorial um, with double n. And the next thing we need to create a radiance function double radiance. double angle it has a function to convert the degrees to uh, radians so we need to initialize the radians as double radians here radians equals um, phi divided by 180 times angle okay and then it will return the value of radians. And the next is we need to create a, a function to find out the value of sin using using a Taylor method. Long double sin Taylor and double. Angle. And then after that, declare the variable long double x equals zero. And then the formula you're using for here for for in the initialized point is equals i equals 1 until i equals more, uh, less than 3 and then add the increment i plus equals 2 and here we will add a if an if statement if 
i equals 3 then the formula x equals x minus bone and radiance angle i divided by factorial i and after that copy it copy this code we add else statement x equals x plus o radians angle divided by factorial i okay and the last thing is that we we'll add a return x okay so the next is uh, create the factorial function uh, we use it long as uh, factorial factorial double n and we add if a statement if n equals less than 1 then return value 1 else it will return n times factorial n minus 1 okay that's it and now in the main program we need to add some sort of codes um, initialize the angle as double and ask for the user input we use C out here to inform the user to input the angle and then we use C in angle to input the angle and after that C out will display the result um, the value of sin angle using Taylor method is we call the function um, scene Taylor here and input the angle send send it to the function scene Taylor and send it back to here and create end line and then after that initialize param and result and um, system result system res and now add a c out um, value of scene angle using um, system calculator is the system rest system rest and give end line so before that we need to add a code to find out the system result 
uh, to find out the value of sin using the system uh, calculator. So system res equals sin. We are using um, the function of the uh, the function of the library using cmath, and then here in sin angle times v divided by 180 and then after that uh, we need to find the difference between the the result of Taylor method and system calculator so um, initialize long long double difference equals uh, system res um, uh, minus um, scene Taylor angle scene Taylor angle all right I think it's an uh, ineffective way to, to uh, write scene Taylor angle so we need to create a variable to store the result of scene Taylor so it could be um, so we initialize double uh, Taylor res equals um, scene Taylor scene Taylor angle Okay, so here we just uh, replace it with Taylor res, and here we also replace it with a Taylor res. Right? And display the difference between system result and Taylor result. So the difference is. difference and okay uh, it's done so we will start the program test it oh I'm sorry there's something wrong it should be seen Taylor okay start sorry this one also And here is our program. So input the angle, for example, um, uh, 30. So here it is the result. The value of scene 30 using Taylor method is 0 0.4, and the value of scene 30 using system calculator is 0 0.5. So the difference is uh, the system calculator result minus uh, the Taylor method result 0 0.5. Uh, minus 0 0.499 etc etc and if we want to start again with another uh, angle for example um, 60 so here's the result you can see the difference between the Taylor method and system calculator and we start again with a 90 so the system calculator is 1 and the with using Taylor method it's 0 0.9 and the difference is 0 0.07 so we think that's all for now uh, we would like to say thank you very much for watching and hope that it is useful for all of us and see you in another video bye bye